Hey. Guess what? You've come to help me fold the laundry. Uh, no. What good is being a witch if I can't just twitch my nose and make the laundry fold itself? Uh, which witch can do that? Samantha Stevens. From Bewitched? Oh, it's only like one of my favorite old television shows. You know, sometimes I forget that you've only been fully human for like a month. I'm becoming more human by the day. What would you say if I became really human and got a job? If that's the criteria for being really human, then I am in big trouble. <laughs> I'm serious. Paige said that a lawyer at Legal Aid quit, so she kind of recommended me. She did? Of course, if you don't think I should, then I... No, no. Um, actually, I think that's a great idea. It'll keep you busy and help you find your identity while I lose mine. I'm sorry? Nothing. Tell me. It's just becoming a wife. I mean, I like Samantha, but I never actually wanted to become her. See, Samantha, she was married to a human, Darren. Darren completely repressed Samantha's magic, completely denied who she was. And it wasn't because he didn't love her. It was just that's the way it had to be. And this was one of your favorite shows? Well, not that part. It's just growing up, that was my only role model for a typical marriage. So that's all I knew. And he was able to meet people and leave the house and go to work and build this career. And she had to stay home, you know, and cook dinner and do the laundry. She went from being Samantha to being Mrs. Darren Stevens overnight. Well, that won't happen to you. Won't it? No. You'll become Mrs. Cole Turner. <laughs> Phoebe, come on. Number one, it was a different time, a different world, obviously. Number two are hardly typical. I proposed to you under a hail of demon goo and you accepted while I was bleeding to death, remember? Look, why don't we just do it again, start over. Gramps' ring. Mm -hmm. Where did you get that? From Piper. She gave it to me so I could give it to you. Well, it's not exactly a good Omen. She was married with that thing six times. <laughs> well, she must have liked something about it, or she would have stopped at like three. <laughs> right? <clears throat> Miss Phoebe Halliwell, I come to you. A man, nothing more, nothing less to ask. Will you be my wife? Hmm. Yeah, I will. Again. Good. Just want to talk. It was an accident. I'm sorry. It's all right. Just let us in. No. Don't yell at me. I'll deal with Tyler. You contact Ludlow. Who's Ludlow? He runs the academy we told you about. I'm not going to boarding school. You can't send me away. Oh, honey, it's for your own good. I told you I didn't mean to do it. I swear I'm not bad. I swear. <sighs> 